Well, today over at Big Spring Park, you may have noticed some people walking the sidewalks of downtown Huntsville. Those people were walking in the seventh annual End Addiction Walk hosted by Not One More Alabama. News 19's Shoals Bureau Chief Reporter Whitney Leibold has more on why this event is so important. <laughs> Smiles and waves and <laughs> cheers as hundreds of people walk through Huntsville knowing there is hope for those struggling with addiction. We are all here celebrating um, people in recovery. We're celebrating uh, people that have lost loved ones to addiction and we're celebrating um, all of the family members that support the mission of, of um, just bringing awareness. We spoke with Kim Holder who is 12 years sober, but she says it starts with one connection. 12 years ago today, I was living in my car knowing that I needed help and not willing to make a connection to get some help. But the connections started coming to me. And so through those connections today, I have a whole new life. People gathered in a circle cheering on those who are on their road to recovery. Today is a day of celebration. Recovery is difficult, but it's possible. We say hope is real, recovery is real. And I think Not One More Alabama does an excellent job keeping the families connected. Over 40 resources were here at Big Spring Park for addiction and recovery services for anybody that needs help. Narcan was also passed out for free for anyone who wanted one. And if you or someone you know is struggling with addiction, you can go to our website, whnt.com, for information on resources. In downtown Huntsville, Whitney Weibel, News 19. And we do have additional resources for you on our website, whnt.com.